As the news spread that Hugo Chavez is finally back in Venezuela, his supporters poured onto the streets to celebrate. But this was no triumphant comeback. Instead, the president arrived under the cover of darkness, announcing his return via Twitter. One message read, We have arrived back in the land of Venezuela. Thank you, Lord. Thanks to my beloved people. We will continue our treatment here. And that was enough for his ardent supporters. I knew. I knew he was coming back. I had faith because we were all thinking about him. The whole world was. I knew he was going to return to his homeland. It's been two months and seven days since we've been waiting for our commander. Some said he wasn't coming back. Media said he was dead online and on Twitter. Some news was uncertain, but we knew he was alive. I'm so happy. When I woke up this morning, I read the news on my phone that he had come back. This is his home, and we're thankful he's alive, and he will always live on. But by the government's own admission, this will be a long and complex recovery. Chavez is reportedly breathing through a tube, but officials say he's still issuing orders. The whole team of Commander Hugo Chavez is here. He is good. He is conscious, and he is very happy to be in his Venezuelan homeland, as he said on Twitter. We are experiencing immense happiness and motivation with the people. For opposition leaders, though, long frustrated by what they view as a deliberate lack of information, calls are growing for a frank discussion about Chavez's future. Bienvenido. I hope the return of the president means there will be some good sense from the government. During the last few weeks, all we've heard are insults. Words of hate, which are turning the Venezuelans against each other. The celebrations will continue here throughout the night, and these people say they'll stay for as long as it takes. But the return of Hugo Chavez has left many questions unanswered. He says he'll overcome and recover, but his apparent confidence won't end the speculation over his immediate future or that of his country. Andy Gallagher, Al Jazeera, Caracas, Venezuela.